Hello everyone, this is Zodiac, and today we're going to do Chamber of Arms, the Ambulant Patriotic Hero. Um, I have made one change in the lineup since the previous video. Power Glacial Laswa will be replacing Roberta. Uh, my reasoning for it was because the second Acolyte has 8 million HP, whereas the boss only has 4.5 million, and that Acolyte really has to go quick. So, we went ahead and put in Laswa because one... He has a powerful limit break for burst damage on a single target. And two, he actually gains access to an ice move later on so we can use him if we need extra insurance on the boss. Alright, so it looks like everything will be fine here to start with. Okay. So he's going to summon his dudes, they're all going to buff, and at this point, Daybaw can't even be touched. Alright, so our first focus will be on the Shaman. Well, first things first, they're all buffed, so let's get that out of the way. We'll go ahead and cast Dispelga, and we're going to cast Rerez on, I think, Barrel because I believe... The magic dealer is the worst of the two. Okay. We're going to go ahead and open with Arcadia's Might. So everybody gets a ridiculous amount of stat buff. And we're going to throw it in reverse on them with General's Manifesto. Okay. Single target. Provoke with Wilhelm and magic cover with Barrel. Okay, there goes their turn. Okay, so right off the bat, not a lot going for them. Wilhelm did get stopped though. Okay, so that's a workaround. Alright, so we need to remove Lauren and Lucius okay yeah those are my two non emotional damage dealers okay we're going to do stop detach just to prevent any further stop from going through Okay. Single target shaman. We're going to do piercing barrage. And Laswell is going to do. Well, I don't think I've got much really to chain with here. So we're just going to go with obliterating mirror of equity. Hopefully, the two there will be enough to take it out. Damn close. Okay. Um, go ahead and have Barrel start having you not guilty. Okay, yeah, chance of being targeted. All right, so he does have that, so we'll defend this turn. So far, it looks like with our battle prep, there's not, they're not dealing a lot. So we're going to go ahead and remove the Shaman. Okay, he's gone. Actually going to use this opportunity to start. Um, actually, no, there's no turn limit wins on this, I believe. While we're here... Three espers, lightning, water, wind, and earth twice, and kill blow with magic. There is no turn limit. So, yeah, I can think this through. We're going to go ahead and with him. Just absolute defense, just for the heck of it. Barrel's going to go ahead and continue with heaven, ye not guilty. Okay. And Yaka, we're just going to do purify plus with a barrier. 
This Acolyte will only do physical attacks, and its AoE Earth isn't going to be that strong, honestly. With barrels healing and... <laughs> looks like... Chamberlain's expertise, we're, we're going to bowl it over. Um, I am going to make a swap, though. We're going to go ahead and bring in Medinia. And we're also going to bring in uh, Yuna. Okay. So, target cultist. Uh, let's do energy blast. And we're going to... Let's just do the energy blast first before we go into double alterna here. Okay, we'll follow that up then. Okay, Wilhelm's going to do single voke. Actually, no, Wilhelm is going to do AoE since there's no magic coming anymore. Barrel can go ahead and continue to do Ye Not Guilty. Of course, the, the, the debuffs and the all that such has fallen off, so. <laughs> and there is Meta Marlboro Counter. So, yeah, the blind actually got there, but then again, we, well, let's be honest. We did play with them a bit. We, we, we let them get that far. All right, let's take it out. All right, he's done. All right. We're gonna we're gonna go ahead and let him have his turn here. All right, so here's the thing. This guy is gonna do absolutely nothing until we get to fifty percent. So we get to use all this time to work on our win cons minus the magic win kill condition. Um, so just to double check. He's got the uh, wind and earth and Yaka has got the thunder and the water. Okay, so Wilhelm's going to walk up, poke him. There's the wind and the earth. That's one each. Yaka does not have double cast, so we'll have to take a few turns on this. Uh, water. Let's just get to water because that one's the one I keep forgetting. I probably could have swapped Barrow out. Do nothing. Yuna, fill the gauge. Okay. And... Yeah, she does no thun thunder. There we are. Just a little dink. Uh, we can take Barrel out now. We don't need him in. I am going to build a few limit break gauges, though. Okay, Wilhelm is going to do Wind, Earth. These two can just repeat. Water, Thunder. Okay, there's the elementals covered. Yuna now just needs to build gauge. And... <laughs> I apologize for this looking very boring, guys, but we're going to take the advantage here of being able to get all these wind cons out of the way while it's not doing anything. All right. Wilhelm's done. We can take him out. Let's bring Lauren in. All right. I'm trying to see if there is anything we can do. They can increase the limit break fill rates for everybody because we kind of need to do this. I'm afraid not. All right, block, block. Uh, Learning embrace just to get a non lethal out. 
I guess Ayaka is going to spam dedication for a while. And Medina is going to defend. All right, let's take Medina out and bring in Laswell. A lot of these guys are <laughs> down near full already. All right, let's take her back to prayer, dedication, defend. Done. Okay, uh, Laswell's done. And the bug continues, folks. Can't get away from that bug. Ah, uh, man, it's annoying. They really need to fix this for iPad. All right. Very quickly, Laswell out for Devil Boy here. Fill the gauge, dedication, block, wait turn. The other reason why I'm keeping the uh, Lauren and Zargabath out is so that way their cooldowns can, re can redo. Lucius is done. All right. Bring him out. Let's go ahead and get Hyo in. He's the last one that might need a limit break. So we'll just go ahead and just maintain at this point. Prayer, dedication, block, dot, dot, dot. Zargabath is going to take a while to fill. Okay. Esper summon number two. Larry Embrace. Showboating. Okay. Go ahead and continue to refill the gauge one last time. Prayer. Skip. Repeat. Okay. Yuna can summon Lakshmi one more time. There's your third Esper. And with that, everyone has a full limit break gauge. Now, I do want Kyo to have access to triple cast. So we're going to do Way of the Void. Actually, hold on, hold on. Got a better idea. Anyone that's on the kill team, we're going to buff them right now. 150 plus percent with Zargabath. And we're going to bring them back in when they're ready to go. So we're going to go ahead and do this. Oh, what? Hey, you got to be kidding me. Wow. Okay, whatever. Dedication. All right, and the bug returns. Gosh, dang, this is just... Huh. That's why I don't like swapping people around so much. So, yeah, we've been recording for, I think, five minutes, and he's just been standing there. Uh, I, I get that, you know, killing the ads and having the LML swap and all that was probably part of the part and partial to the difficulty of this. But come on, guys. Maybe you could have done something here. All right. So he's going to do Way of the Void just so he gets that trip cast. And we're going to have Zargi here just do Alexander Crest. This is to make sure that everyone that's dealing damage has their big buffs. Now we can start getting a kill team ready, or push team ready. 
So we're going to get Wilhelm back in. Uh, him back in. We can bring... Well, we need the Medina in. Ayaka can come in now. We need everyone in that is... Oh, my God. Okay. I apologize, folks. I, I've got no way around this, but I'm trying to... I, I'm meticulous with my unit setups, and the game just simply does not allow me that time limit. Yes. All right. Mm. Actually, let's do that. Okay, that looks good. All right, so we have everyone in that doesn't require physical weapons to kill because at 50%, he's going to give everybody a darkness imbue, and we do not want that on our physical attackers. So at this point, um, we're going to have Medinia start getting that ice consecutives built. Yes, we could have started earlier, but... If we have a time to get, you know, wind conditions and set up, I am going to take it. Okay, so we're starting there. Now she can start dual casting Raging Ice. Okay, let's break them now. Go ahead and push a little damage with uh, Vengeance Blade. That's what I was looking for. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. Let's start getting our uh, tank stuff ready. And re reses now. Since we've kind of gotten to that point. Yeah, that's right. Do the covers this turn. Okay, so he's going to transition maybe this turn. We're going to go ahead and have Medina go first, but we're going to make sure that the elemental debuffs are still up like Freeze. So Freeze, Raging Ice. Okay, that's the transition. So Barrel is going to do Born to Die. Oh, actually, no. Do we do Born to Die Heaven mode yet? I think I defend. Let's just defend, make sure. Wilhelm, defend. Ayaka is going to put Re-Res double on... Let's do Medinia and herself. Now the real fight is finally about to begin, and we're only 22 turns in.
Okay. He did, in fact, do Dark Confinement, and it did kill Beryl. I should have done his hell move there. Meta Marlboro went off, but didn't do anything. Okay. We need to kill that Shaman this turn. No one is buffed, and we still have the debuffs on that guy. Okay, so we need to bring in Laswell and Lucius. We also have got to break these guys. Okay, we're going to start by breaking them all. Okay, so that's about 74 across the board. Now, we're going to have these guys single target their limit breaks. They were buffed before we went in, so this should hopefully be enough. If not, we might be in trouble. This is the hardest part right here is killing this guy. Okay, 60%. That's not bad. Um, totally clips. And Wilhelm still has his buff up for evoking. Yeah, he defended last turn, so he's got one turn left. So we'll do absolute defense this turn. Okay, they rebuffed, unfortunately, so that kind of hurts us. All right. Yeah, they all rebuffed. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate because we have to dispel these guys. Oh, dang it. Hmm. Well, actually, there is a way around it. I just realized there's a way around. We bring in a Yaka for Barrel. And we do this. Dispelga, all of them, and Rerez Wilhelm. Okay, let's let those go off. Lauren's got a little break. And this is to get all the brakes back on them. All right. We're going to... Should be ultimate... Uh, mirror of equity somewhere. Absolute mirror of equity, yeah. And Lucius is going to limit break again because he refilled his gauge. Wow. Yep, the shaman's now gone. Okay. Wilhelm has to provoke now. He can do the full cover since we've got him out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, that, that's not bad. That's recoverable. That's actually pretty favorable. Yep, full broke. So it's kill team time. All right, we're going to throw the kitchen sink at him. And Laswell has access to, yeah. Yuna can get in on the action too, but I don't want her dying on me. So just in case, uh, <sighs> we took too long again. And this is the, and again, this is just one of those, you know, important parts of the fight where we got to have him killed. Magic kill condition. So we might be casting double Alterna. 
probably will be casting double alterna actually to make sure we get it. Yeah. <sighs> this bug, man. I, really? It, this game's bound and determined now. <laughs> yes, I'm on iPad if anyone's curious why. I don't know if it's a bug with the iPad. I don't know if it's a bug with the game, but... Yeah, this has probably been the, a more intense one where I'm having to swap people out because I'm very meticulous with my setups. All right. Just got to take my time, move efficiently, make sure we get everyone in we need to. I think... Yeah, barrel just in case, yeah. Yeah. Okay, Dave. Uh, I am going to dual cast. We're just going to set up for. Wait. Sorry, I got to check his debuffs again. Yeah, Lauren put up the light debuff too. The, the ice one is gone, but we may not even need it. Okay. Huh. Well, the triple cast is gone. Probably fell off at some point, but I don't think I ever brought him back in. I'm kind of irked about that. All right, we're going to try to chain this out in insufficient imp. Oh, oh shit. Well, okay, that's not a problem. Um, reading eyes, alterna. Yep. Rectum. Okay, now at this point, Barrel is going to do Alone in the Dark. Actually, no, he's going to do Everyone's Grudge. Let's just make sure we get this over with. All right, so heretic persecution. Everyone's hope. Everybody's healed up. At this point, we, we can... Whoa, hello. <laughs> All right. Swap in Yuna. All right, we're going to put... Re-res is up just to be on the safe side. She's got dual cast now, so go down here. Re-res Barrel, re-res uh, PG Laswell. Limit Break. Yeah, he's going to resist a lot there. Um, guilty. Go ahead and buff everyone. We're on the home stretch, boys. <laughs> Shadow counter, man. That's ridiculous. All right. Yo is going to just unknown traitor debuff him. Yuna is going to do Heart of the Faith. Zargavath's going to buff everyone again. Barrel's just going to do uh, you not guilty. And last worm is going to do a simple mirror of equity. Yes, mirror of equity. Bing. Oh no, Barrel, you died. All right, Yuda, let him have it. Actually, no, no. One sec. Is anyone going to break? Ah, Barrel, let Yuna have it first, just in case. Yeah, once you're down to the cultist, guys, it's easy. And done. So, nice one shot. And we still won with under 30 turns. Alrighty. So, guys, the fight 
is actually very easy. It just requires uh, some degree of <laughs> planning, and it's 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 doable. Yeah. The only thing I messed up on was uh, the transition. I should have did barrels, you know, damage mitigator. But there it is, all done. And we've only got two of these arms bosses left to go. So I thank everybody for tuning in, and I wish you luck, and I hope the video is a massive help on this fight. I'll see you all later on.